My uh, name is Deputy uh, Leo Basbed. I'm with the Sheriff's Office here, Alameda County. Uh, How with, long have you been with Been them? with the Sheriff's Office for approximately five years and been out on um, patrol for approximately one year now. And uh, spend my time in the jail, initiation in the jail, uh, worked at the airport, and, uh, and now I'm here having a good time. And uh, tell us a little bit about the police presence here in Castro Valley and, and what you, how you think it benefits the community. Well, uh, here at the Sheriff's Office, uh, I think all of us uh, take great pride in what we do. We have a, a, a really proactive sheriff and uh, he instills his, uh, his values into us and, and we like to go after things. Uh, you know, we like to stay on top of stuff. The more proactive we are, the less reactive we are. So, uh, uh, just talking to the citizens here, it seems like they appreciate what we do, and uh, you know, it feels good to do some good and have some appreciation from some of the citizens that uh, you're around every day. And uh, what do you think of Castro Valley in comparison to its surrounding areas? Um, it's a uh, just in general, it's a nice area, um, and I think that. Uh, we have a lot to do with that, you know, uh, when we're out and about. Um, just from what I've heard, that you know, people know that if the sheriff's is, sheriff's around, uh, which kind of a, it's kind of a pun, but if the sheriff's around, you know, that you know they're not out doing too much dirt, you know, that they know that uh, we're going to talk to them, and you know, if they're doing some dirt, there's a good chance they might have to go to jail. We're detailed to a shoplifting call. Employees at Safeway have one person detained. They said he's not fighting, uh, so he should be in the back room right now. And they had me in jail for two weeks. The judge was talking to me like, why you do this? You know better. You don't have to have a criminal, you feel me? You're, criminal, you mean? You're a follower. You what's, your, what's your address? I don't even know it. You're 17, man. You're almost an adult. How are you going to be walking around? Okay, okay, you know, I, was, I was with my dad. You feel me? Because no. when I was with my mom, Where's, you don't know your address right now. I just moved in with my mom. Okay. okay. Don't you live on John Street, yeah. off of Foothill, yeah. just right down the way, in apartment number seventeen? No. No. Are you guys gonna arrest him? Because he's on probation. You guys can take him to juvenile hall if you want. Yeah, but they won't keep him because of the violence. It's not a violent man. All right, it's good. He has court in a couple of weeks, and he sure in the hell will go in. Right. Oh, he, that's what he was asking me. He goes, my probation officer going to know about oh, this? Oh, yeah, uh, he's gonna, she's going to know. Monday morning, I'm calling her. This is shit, Anthony. You're a dude. I just took custody of him on Thursday. For the same thing? No, custody from his piece of shit dad that he has. My license expired. But. <laughs> This is ridiculous. Are you serious, dude? Are you kidding me right now? We got detail here for a uh, person detained for shoplifting. Uh, turns out it's a 17-year-old juvenile tried to steal a bottle of alcohol. Uh, I guess he didn't put up any fight or anything. Uh, Mom just arrived, so uh, he's going to be arrested, cited, and released to his mother's custody. Uh, he's already on probation. So uh, he's going to end up going to court and he may uh, get additional charge for his probation violation as well. What city do you work out of? Um, I don't really have. Uh, so you travel just yeah. wherever. You got a massage table, so you must be doing okay. So you're not up to. You? He didn't book a massage with you. Oh no, 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 no. no I promise. I'm not. Uh, don't promise. I'm, I'm just yeah, asking. I'm Saying, I mean, just the way it looks, you know, oh, on okay. its face. Okay. You're telling me you're a massage therapist. Well, you have a massage you table. Obviously, the table was in the back of your car. You that's took it out. I was carrying it. Uh -huh. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You're not under arrest. I'm just detaining you. All right. Interlock. Interlock the back of your table. Yeah, just like that. Yeah. 
you have any, this is your car here? Yes, sir. You don't mind if we search it, right? Nothing illegal in your car, right? Okay? Okay, like I said, you're not, you're not under arrest, yeah. but you are on probation, yeah. all right, yeah. uh, for possession of drugs, correct? Yeah. Out of Yellow County, right? Uh, nothing illegal in your car? Yeah. Okay. All right, come with me. You're going to take a seat for a minute, okay. and then uh, if everything is okay, you'll get out. Sure. Come on. Come on. Oh, please be something. That's what I'm talking about. Right there. Yep. Good to go. She could be a 1015. There's not nothing okay. in there. Sir. All right. Well, I'm not. I'm not here to argue with you. That's what the court system's for. Okay. You understand what I'm saying? I'm just. I'm just telling you. Listen. Listen. I don't know. Listen. It was in your car, in your bag, okay? In my so, bag? Yeah, so maybe you forgot it was in there, I don't know. No, there's right. none, sir. Sit back. Sit back, all oh the way back. God. Sit back, all the way back. I need to put my pants on because I don't have any under. Right. Well, gonna for now, I'll grab your pair of pants. For now, you're going to be like that. Hey, hey. In there. All right, so basically we were detailed up here. Uh, suspicious circumstance. Two cars out here in the middle of nowhere. Um, we get here. We? Uh, this is uh, northbound on Eden Canyon Road. I'd say a good four miles uh, north of the freeway. Really sparsely populated area. So all the, all the people around here know who's supposed to be around here. So I'm sure they, someone called and, and uh, was concerned. So we find uh, this young lady and this gentleman in uh, her car. She's uh, already had priors for drug possession. We search her vehicle, find some more uh, more illegal substances. So she's gonna go to jail and uh, we're gonna tow her vehicle. Rather than leave it here and take the chance of it being stolen or broken into. The handle. Just down the oh, road. Oh, let me take it. Let me see. 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 Let me She is really here. Uh, he's got the. You got the. You're gonna, He's gonna take the keys and she wants him to take the car. Okay. I can't get a small. What's it? Got a hole in my glove, but uh, and this and it's blue, which is affirmative, which is real deal. Uh, yeah, perfect. Uh, violence again. Okay, lay your bike down for me. Yeah, sure, no problem. How long? Huh? How long have you been on public? Uh, probably like, I just went to the, uh, maybe I'm out of breath because fucking... Nothing oh, legal on you? Yeah, no, no. Alright. Yeah, nothing sharp? No, no. No weapons, no nothing like that? No, no. Alright, no, separate no. your feet. Yeah, yeah I wish I would have done something else together. Well, it's not, <laughs> it's not bad, but... Not, I got any jersey. Anymore. I didn't see... Is your light on there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What is that? What is that? I, 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 was, I was just smashing my bike and uh, the, the chain's messed up on her, so uh -huh. I was So I was just right Do you have ID, boss? Yeah, it should be in this pocket. Yeah. It's kinked, I was just circling the parking lot. You know you weren't, you just pulled in the car and you see me circling. Well, I saw a shadow. Okay. That's why I came in here. Yeah, but it, it, I, it didn't look like somebody on a bike, it looked like somebody. Oh, yeah, no, not the, no. I just didn't know if you had seen me like over there because I was circling around the parking lot, so I was trying to. It skipped and messed up. How long up. you. For domestic violence? Yeah. Were yeah. you convicted? 
yeah, well, I think so. I just got out of, I just got out of jail, uh, it's about last week. Okay. Yeah, last week, all so right. we're all good with everything, yeah. Okay. You're not under arrest, I'm just trying yeah, to figure out, you know. I know. You're good to go. Right on. All right. Yeah, you're all good. No problem with that at all. Pipe off? Yes, sir. Alright. Uh, probation for domestic violence. It says it, it, the last time I got, uh, I, I got stuck for a few months ago back, um, uh, my buddy went to school with Marcus Dodds, which is, uh, but, uh, it came, it came up as, uh, as drugs, and then, uh, not only, not only was it, not only was it drugs, man. Put your feet together for me? Yeah, sure. Not only was it drugs, uh, it was It said that I, I had possession, possession. Close your eyes, close your head back, and just stay busy. When's the last time you used any drugs? Uh, a while ago. It's been a while, so like, I just got out of jail. Like, I'm in three, four days? No, hell no. No, not oh. even that. Oh. Uh, probably months. Months? I've been, months? I've been doing pretty good. Maybe. What do you use, What do you use if you do you? Oh, I used to use uh, a pot, crystal. Crystal? Yeah. Yeah, crystal meth. Nothing on you tonight, though? We're all good, yeah. Okay. I'm all good. I got, I got uh, North, weekends in North County tomorrow, so. Whose bike is that? It's mine. Yeah. All right. You're on probation. They confirmed it, so I'm just okay, going to make sure. <laughs> Charles 36, George 9850. Yeah, so <laughs> Out on the street, man. I knew, I knew what it was. I'm pretty sure I know what it is. I'm not sure if I know what it exactly is, but I found it. Looked folded up like something, and I picked it up, put it right in the parking lot. I didn't even. I wouldn't even believe me if I would have got rid of that. A little bit of coke or what? I don't know what it is. I really don't. You know? I seriously found it on the street. I kid you not. I kid you not. I didn't know what it is. That's why it's been in my pocket. Did you found it on the street, folded up like yeah, that? Yeah, yeah, I did. I swear to God, bro. I am not kidding you. <laughs> I didn't even know what it was, I, that's why I didn't use it or give it to anybody I know that's still used or any of that. Damn, I didn't know. I hope it's not anything. <laughs> oh, you go over there to the internet place and play? Uh, no. Yeah, not These really. are the cards, right? Yeah, I mean, I've been there a couple times. You ever He says though his best guess is, you know how when you clean when you're smoking dope, he said, you know when you're smoking dope, and you want to clean the bowl out, the leftover residue is a little bit discolored, so it's kind of shiny, it's kind of crystally. Yeah, so, it looks like, uh, but he, he's not. I'm thinking. Old school Mexican pistol. And bingo. Methamphetamine. Basically, this guy um, riding, riding his bike at night. Uh, he doesn't have a headlight on his bike that works and basically it's a lighting equipment issue so that was my uh, probable cause for stopping him and talking to him. Uh, he's on probation uh, for a battery and uh, drug possession. He had a, a search clause, so we searched him and in that little coin pocket we found a little bit of methamphetamine uh, folded up inside this piece of paper. We tested it. 
tested affirmative for uh, amphetamines and he's gonna go to jail for the night and hopefully uh, we uh, prevented someone's house from being broken into or cars from being broken into or something so it worked out yeah you're gonna hold on to your hat this is just your property with your clothes Visa card MasterCard uh, your plastic bracelet that has your name on it, okay. your Hawaii cell track phone, your driver's license, your shoelaces, okay? Yeah. You taking prescription medications? Yeah. Okay. The past 24 hours, have you lost consciousness? Have you seen the breathing problems? Mm -hmm. Any... Have you had any drugs or alcohol today? Uh, no. And do you have any injury illnesses? You take time? All right, right shoulder against the wall. All right, okay, so later. Which one? All right, come on over here, Jeff. All right, good luck. All right, thank you very much, sir.